No, I, I think it's irrelevant. Again, if we were to beat them, they beat us by two points. If we were to beat them, we'd be on level points. So, you know, that's how tight the competition is. And they've been in very good form this year. And we've been in pretty good form as well. So, uh, again, it's really irrelevant where we are on the table. You're right, I think the teams are evenly matched. Uh, they're very healthy. You know, we're missing a couple. But we're pretty confident going into this one. If we, you know, if we play well, uh, we'll give ourselves every chance of winning the game. Certainly a challenge. And... You know, um, looking forward to the challenge. Should be a good game, and um, I think all the boys are keen and ready, ready to play. How's your confidence levels yourself personally? Yeah, I'm feeling pretty confident. Eh? I'm played pretty good over the last month or so, so um, my form's going pretty good, and hopefully, um, I just can ca carry the form into the weekend, and it should be sweet. No, I don't think revenge comes into this. The prize at the end of this is too big. You know, it's not about them. It's about us, and uh, we've got an opportunity to to go forward into the semi-finals. So, you know, we understand they're going to be as hungry as us. Uh, again, it's whoever does the little things well, and uh, whoever comes up and and plays the best on the day. I think the the both teams are are very close, and there's not a hell of a lot in them. So, it's going to be the best team on the day again. It's a long time ago when we played them, and uh, even though we've lost three on the bounce in Super League. Uh, we're in pretty good form and we're not far away, so you know, we prove on a couple of little areas and you know, as I said, we'll give ourselves every chance. Is it big teams, uh, some big teams out of the, the competition? Uh, Leeds Rhinos, Bradford Bulls, beat Huddersfield, you fancy yourself uh, going forward maybe to the final, maybe to Wembley? Well, yeah, again, if you look at the table, you know, whole KR are up there and Huddersfield are up there and um, you know, there's a bit of a different look about it, so I'm not too sure if if uh, you know uh, all of that, those teams you're talking about are the big teams now um, again that you know, it's changing uh, the competition's changing and you know certainly what Huddersfield have done in the last few years have been very impressive not only on the field but off the field and you know what they've done with their crowds and obviously getting to a challenge cup final a couple of years ago so you know well, that's good to see obviously not good from Bradford's point of view but you know I'm sure they'll be back uh, but you know we Again, I don't think you can take anything for granted, and it doesn't matter who you're playing. Uh, we've got a hell of a lot of respect for Huddersfield and, and, and their coach and, and their players, and um, you know, I'm sure the same is for us from their side of things. So again, everything points to a cracking game of rugby, and uh, uh, you know, we're just hoping that we're on the right side of the result. Yeah, we owe them one. So you know, we played them earlier in the year, and it was a close game. Um, I think we should have won that game as well, but. They played well and defended well and um, we've done our video on that on them so hopefully this time we can come up with the two points. So as you say, the right side of the result for you guys, um, it'd be special to get to Wembley wouldn't it? It is, again we've still got a bit of work to do even you know, if we do win this game but you, know, you can see it, uh, you can feel the excitement around the town, you know, this club's steeped in some, some great history in the Challenge Cup. So. You know, I feel the people can feel that again, but uh, again, it's a little bit too far away to, you know, to, to put your house on it. Again, th this game on Sunday means everything, and that's you know, that's our only focus at the moment. So, um, as I said, a, a great occasion and a great opportunity that we don't want to let slip. So, in the Huddersfield camp, are you going to be looking at anybody in particular that's going to cause any problems for, for the Tigers? They've got a hell of a lot of strike. Um, again, their, their halves and their hooker. Uh, Brett Hodgson, the fullback, has, has been instrumental in everything they've done. They're a massive pack of forwards who, who have been you know, dominant for, for a long time this year. And uh, again, you know, we need to stop them at the middle. Again, and we understand that. Uh, they've been doing a lot of things well, and it's up to us to stop them. We know where they're going to come at us, we know what they're going to do, and uh, I'm sure they know what we're going to do. You know, there's not going to be too many surprises from both sides, but again, um, it's, it's how we do that, and uh, yeah, we've got a big task in front.